Hi learners, welcome back to another video lesson in TLA 9 Bread and Pastry. Our topic for today, Types, Kinds, and Classification of Bakery Products. Definition of Terms First, leavening agent. Leavening agent is a substance used to make a baked product rice. Number two, dissolve. Dissolve means to liquefy or to become incorporated into a liquid so as to form a solution. Next is fermentation. Fermentation is defined as a process involving yeast or other microorganisms breaking down a substance. Fourth, gluten. Gluten is a protein naturally found in some grains including wheat, barley, and rye. It acts like a binder holding food together and adding a stretchy quality. Fifth, knead. Knead means to massage or squeeze with the hands. Sixth, dough. Dough means a thick, malleable mixture of flour and liquid used for baking into bread or pastries. Butter. Butter is a thin dough that can be easily poured into a pan. Eight, bake. Bake means to cook by dry heat without direct exposure to a flame, typically in an oven or on a hot surface. Nine, tender. Tender means easy to cut or chew, not tough. Number 10, crust. Crust is a hard outer portion or a surface of a loaf or a pie. Types, kinds, and classification of bakery products. Preparing bakery products requires no trick but adequate mastery of the processes in terms of baking. Classification of bakery products Bakery products are the easy, ready-made food items which are easily available on demand. These are available from long time but now the liking of these items is increasingly rapidly. In the present era, there is a large number of bakery products available in the market. The popular bakery products are being classified as under Number 1. Bread In modern days, bread is becoming one of the most essential food items in human diet due to its ready-made availability and high nutritive value. It is the most consumable wheat-based bakery products and it is the most popular breakfast item in almost every family all over the world. Number two, biscuits. Biscuits are the important items of bakery industry. It has now become a common item of consumption among all classes of community. It is within the reach of even lower class people, and it is the most common snack used by all the people, especially children. 
Number 3. Cake. Cake is a new bakery product compared to the other bakery products being sold at the bake shop. It was earlier famous in the western countries but now become very popular in the other parts of the world too. Number 4. Pastries. This bakery product is sweet in taste and is a highly perishable food product. Its taste is very much similar to the cream cakes and is found in small pieces. It is made with wheat flour or all-purpose flour, cream, sugar, fruit flavors, chocolates, etc. Number 5. Pies A baked dish which is usually made of a pastry dough, casing that contains a filling or various sweet or savory ingredients. Sweet pies may be filled with fruits, nuts, or brown sugar, and savory pies may be filled with meat. Types of bread Quick bread and yeast bread Quick bread this type of bread uses baking powder or baking soda as leavening agent. Kinds of quick bread Pancake or griddle cake It is also known as hot cake. It is a flat cake, often thin, round, prepared from flow-based butter. Fritters. The name fritter is given to a several fried foods made from a butter. They are either pan fried or deep fried. Banana fritters are very popular in the Philippines. Next is donuts. Donuts are very popular in many countries and prepared in different forms at home or purchased at bake shops. Usually, deep-fried ring donut or filled donut. Next is muffin. It is a type of semi-sweet quick bread similar to cupcakes, usually less sweets than cakes with no icing. Fruits, nuts, raisins, Berries can be added to muffins. Next is cupcake. Cupcake is a small cake designed to serve one person, which may be baked in a small thin paper or aluminum cup, and is typically served with icing or frosting. Yeast bread. This type of bread are living by yeast. Yeast as a leavening agent is one of the oldest ways of baking breads. Ingredients for making yeast breads. Number one, flour. The primary ingredient in making bread and the best flour that is being used for making bread is the bread flour. Number two, yeast. Yeast is the leavener in bread making which makes the bread rise. Number three, sugar. It is used or flavored to make brown crust and as food for yeast. Number four, salt. It improves the flavor of breads and prevents the over rising of the dough. Number 5. Liquid It binds flour to develop gluten and to dissolve the yeast. Number 6. Egg The egg makes bread tender, rich in flavor, and golden brown. It also strengthens the framework of the baked products. Number 7. Fat Added to enrich 
dough and to keep bread soft longer. It gives the breads moist crumbs with the soft crust. Basic Steps in Bread Making Number 1. Dissolve yeast in warm water or warm milk with a little sugar. Number 2. Add other ingredients and mix to form a dough. Number 3. Knead the dough until it is smooth and elastic. Number 4. Fermentation it is a term referring to the first rising of the dough. Number five, punch down the risen dough. Number six, shape the dough into desired shapes and sizes. Number seven, proof the shape dough. Number eight, bake the bread until it is done. Kinds of dough. There are two kinds of dough that is being used in making bread. Lean dough and rich dough. Lean dough means it is made of basic ingredients for bread such as flour or the bread flour, yeast as the leavening agent, sugar, and salt. Now for the rich dough, aside from the basic ingredients, it has added ingredients such as butter, milk, eggs and other ingredients how much have you learned directions identify the correct answer write your answer on your paper your timer starts now Time is up. Let's check your answers. And that's it for today. I hope you learned something and see you on my next lesson.